Hey there, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So a different setting today. We are actually in LA. I'm here for an event. It's actually the Evolve Awards after party. Um, but this is a video I've been wanting to do. And since I tend to wake up really early when I'm in LA, sorry, my phone. Um, end up working like a, waking up in the, like five in the morning because of the time change. I have some free time and I'm gonna show you what's in my bag. So this is something I've been wanting to do. You guys, some of you ladies have asked me like to do it with just a fun like what's in your bag. Um, yes video whatever and so i think because this is i i just brought like an overnight bag well not overnight but um a carry-on bag that's why i want to share what's in my bag right now because when i just travel with a carry-on i pretty much abuse my handbag so this is usually my travel bag this is the goya large saint louis and it's pretty good it's been with me for a while it's seen some tough times i really abuse this bag when i like i say when i travel with the carry-on bag because i try to fit as much as possible here so i have enough space in my carry-on so that's why okay so let's get down to it so i'm sorry if the lighting i'm taking advantage so we ha i have like a big window here so that's why i'm doing it but um it's not the same anyway so let's do this okay first off when i'm carrying i usually take makeup so this is a larger makeup case that i found i used to travel with a smaller one but i decided to go for something bigger um because now this one i use it and i can actually fit some of my toiletries in here so instead of carrying two or three bags which i would usually do i got this one this is from base or bees or it's shea mitchell's line it's really good it actually comes with a little mirror um brush compartment and then pretty much um face cream so a skincare makeup remover makeup there's a whole lot so i like it you can actually fit more stuff in there it's pretty heavy so i mean not the case everything i have in there. um computer uh, usually i hate bringing my computer when it's such a short trip but i am in between a couple work things campaigns and things like that that i had to make sure they went live and just edit and everything if not i would just avoid because i hate adding some weight um so yeah I'm gonna put this here i just noticed i'm actually blending in with the floor the floor is actually black so. <laughs> okay so another tip is if i am uh, saving up space in my carry-on, I usually put all my purses or handbags inside this one. Um, even if it's a bigger one, I've traveled with a larger bag and I put stuff in there. I fill that bag up and then put it inside. So this time around, I'm just bringing two small bags. So I decided to bring this one just for like right now and I'm going out to lunch and things like that. And this little guy, which I'm going to use for the event tonight. So, um... They tend to take up a lot of room in your carry-on bag, so just because of their shape. So I try to put them in here and it actually saves a little bit more. Okay, what else do we have? It's a mess in here. Oh, I should be embarrassed. <laughs> okay, what else? Headphones. Um, not sure if you guys want to review. I'm really happy with these. I bought them a couple years ago. Love them. The battery lasts a really long time. These are the Beats. So. Not sure you, were, you wanted that little piece of advice. Sleep mask, which I never use. I try to use it, but I'm terrible. I think I have some weird fear that if I put it on, something's gonna grab my leg. I don't know. Um, I need light. I'm a child. I need to sleep with some light or the TV or something. Snacks. There's always some kind of snack, either, either chips, cookies, crackers, candy in my bag. This time around, pistachios. <laughs> um, wet ones really good tip um to carry on when you travel you never know when you're gonna need them so these are antibacterial wipes i love them so another tip this is a bag that pretty much i only use it to travel so basically some things actually stay in here like the wet wipes have been in here for a while and i literally don't take them out so um so yeah that's it nice. retainer box which is in the bathroom <laughs> Um, I'm on the Invisaligner, so this is it. A little brush. I'm getting my hair cut today. Well, just trimmed a little bit. So I decided not to, why not, put 
bring a whole lot of hair stuff so i just brought my curler and a round brush for the hair dryer but i didn't even bring like like an actual brushing brush is that what you call it brushing brush sunglasses these are some of my favorite you've probably seen me wearing them a lot um love these i do this is another tip i'll show you eventually maybe one time um i do have a larger case that came with some really big sunglasses and that one's like a hard let me see if I can put, I'll put a photo here. So what I do is on in that one, I can fit up to four sunglasses if they're slim, if they're kind of like these, like the Ray-Bans. Um, so when I'm doing like a longer trip or I want more sunglasses, maybe when you're going to the beach or things like that, I put that box and you can fit more than one instead of having to carry like four of these. If you're one of those that likes to switch it up. Empty water bottle. <sighs> no idea where this came from i think this is arturo's from like a month ago Sorry. um foundation that i forgot to throw into my makeup bag scrunchie this i do love i wear it um it's one of those soap ones so maybe to sleep uh, okay keep it on hair clip i i'm one of those that forgets a bunch of things so sometimes when i'm running out the house i remember and i start throwing random things in the bag so that's why they're sometimes like on their own like they're singles in here perfume this is a little travel perfume um they have them in different chanel does this little thingy like you twist it and spray um so it's a little glass and you can just like buy the replacements so this is really convenient um if you don't want to carry a whole lot wallet this is my everyday wallet it's a good size so it's don't think it's like my just my travel wallet you can see it's like the size of my hand um this is the one i, I wear or use all the time so it's not exclusively to travel um lip balm apparently there's two this i love the bird's bees uh, medicate this is the medicated another bird's bees <laughs> i took this to the wedding we went in connecticut and it was really cold my lips got really chopped so i chopped chapped well oh, just dry whatever um so i ended up buying a whole lot of these i don't know why room key gum always bring gum tissue this is usually for arturo Arturo's old. he has really bad allergies so he's always carrying with tissues so i'm always stuck with little tissues but anyway it's a good idea to bring them more gum plain checks bag checks, napkins, more napkins, huh, 10 Mexican pesos, okay, my Mexican followers are going to kill me, pesos, <laughs> you do not say, I know in English you usually say pesos and it's pesos, um, but sometimes when you're just speaking it comes out, but yeah, Mexican pesos, there you go, two Mexican pesos, <laughs> everything is such a mess here okay random socks i'm telling you this bag poor thing is a mess no i do throw in some socks um just in case because sometimes I, i'm forgetting them or something so i throw in a pair of socks and there it was for the wedding so they're little stickies um you know for a dress in case any guys are watching this or whatever it's not uncomfortable what you just wear it's for events and weddings these like breast pedals or something like that i think that's what they're called and a bracelet that i was forgetting that i'm gonna wear probably tonight there you go and um, okay so this bag comes with this little um wallet and basically i just have change in there and it's all mexican pesos probably from last time i was there and yeah that's pretty much it i have a couple more Hair ties that are lost in there. One more hair clip. And that is it. That is the mess that is my travel bag. So, <laughs> um, hope you liked it. Don't judge me for being such a messy person. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. You can follow me at the Toasty Life for more daily stuff and just follow up on everything we're, we're doing. And I hope to see you guys again here soon. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, share it, and click the notification bell so you don't miss any of our videos. Bye.